Hi, this is Tris, and welcome to another show me video for using WordPress. We're here in chapter seven where we've been talking all about themes, which is awesome. Love themes. And in another video, I showed you how to find themes. Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how to install them. And uh, we're going to do this uh, a couple different ways. We're going to do this through the admin area where we are now, and then we're going to do it sort of the old school way with uploading them. And I'm going to show you a couple a little side trick as well in the sort of nouveau old school way but first let's let's do some the install through this the new admin area and uh, we remember if you in the other movie I, I did a search for tan themes and I saw one that I've used before which I kind of like called desk mess and let's give it a little preview here this shows you uh, what the theme looks like uh, looks like have you know a, a desk blotter or uh, your your bulletin board. It's got a little push pins. We have a cup of coffee here, an iPhone, a pen, um, those kinds of things. It looks pretty. It looks pretty cool. So I'm going to close this. I like this. And now let's install it. I'm going to scroll down and install. And and that's it it's actually now installed and if we go to the regular area of appearance here it is there is desk mess and if we want to activate it we can just activate it here or we can preview it with our own content I recommend you do that when you install a new theme is to before you make it live for sure is to preview it with your own column with your own content just to see what it's gonna look like because sometimes um, it it doesn't look quite as great as as you thought. So well, this is great. We've got that installed, and well, let's let's install another theme another way. Um, sticking with the the tan theme, let's pick this one called Miscellany. It's another tan theme. It is three column. Let's click the preview button here. See what it looks like. Oh, very nice. Has some nice little flourishes here. Looks kind of good, a little retro, almost photo album look. I kind of like that. So I'm going to close this and I'm going to download it just like a plugin. And there it goes, downloading along. Ta da! And it's done. So I'm going to the finder. And there is my archive I just downloaded. And I'm going to unzip it. And there is the folder. Now, to install this, just like with plugins, you can do it manually through FTP. If we go to my FTP client and back up in the sandbox, WP content, and here are themes. And you can, uh, when I, if I refresh this folder, you can see that desk mess is now in there. And if I want to add the new theme, all I need to do is drag miscellany into themes and wait for it to upload. Now the other way to do this, just like with plugins, is in, through the install themes tab, click upload and upload that zip file. And it would do the exact same thing. Now in this case, we that little my transmit has told me it's uploaded. You can see, and I can go to my main appearance manage theme area, and there is miscellany. Again, previewing it, and there it is, all set up. Three column theme that's tan. It looks pretty good. And so that, that's it. That's how you now have installed themes. You have two ways to do it. You can do it through install themes and picking that theme name that you saw and click install and it will do it. Or you download it and you can upload it through here in the administration panel or you can use your handy dandy FTP client. And that's it. This has been Tris for using WordPress chapter seven where we've been talking about themes and this is installing themes.